Hey, thanks for checking out the channel. So this is a tutorial on Matthew Scott solo from the Paul Davids video. And this is kind of proof of what you can do with a uh, pentatonic scale. So first let's talk tone. We've got a Fender American two professionals, Stratocaster, whatever combination of those words works. You can do it with pretty much any stride. He starts on the fourth position, goes to the fifth. He's using vintage gear, but hey, use what you got, right? Uh, I'm using Podgo with Rhett Scholl's AC30 uh, 1964 uh, IR that he has. You can buy in his packs. I've changed it to a Tube Screamer, which he would hate, but you know, here we are. Um, it's got the Cave Reverb um, Deluxe Comp the SXA30 uh, amp. You can get really close without his IR, but if you want the tone I'm using, you can look that up. I'll try to put a link in the description. Um, let's talk about where this starts. So it kind of rakes in, and then you sort of slide your hand down the strings, and then he starts with this, this pre-bend, so you bend it before you pick it, and that's on the 15th fret. And we're if you look at the video, he's tuned down a half step, so the frets are off by one. Um, but if you do it in standard, you start on the 15th fret, and that's like a full step bend. You come down to 13, so three times. And then 14 on the third string. Hammer on the 15 and back to 13, so. And then you got this kind of arpeggio thing. So uh, it's it's kind of like, like you're making a F major seven down here, so you got 14, 13, and 12 on the bottom three strings. So coming up, that would be 12, 13, 14, and then, and then you kind of rake that, and then go to 13 on the first string, uh, and then 15, and then you're you're on that that root, the A minor there. It's A minor pentatonic is mostly what he's what he's in here, and then. Uh, Kind of that same spot again, you slide from the 12th fret on the third string, and then you bend on the fir first string. So slide from 12 to 14. Uh, so slide from 12 to 14, and then 13 to 15 on the, the B string, second string, and then bend on the 12th fret. Uh, let's see. So then you're sliding from 15 to 17. And that's the 15th fret there. And then you kind of got that pre, that little pickup. Bend on the 17, land on the 15. And then you come back up here to the 12th fret and you, on the second string, you're kind of doing both of them and you, you slide. So, uh, you slide into that 12th fret, hit the first string, back to the second string, and then bend on the 15. And then 13 to 15. So, 13, 15, and then pre-bend. 15, 15, and back to A, your root, on uh, the third string there. And then, where does it go from there? Um, <laughs> let's see. Oh, the fun part. So, this is kind of just A minor pentatonic, but he's adding in, uh, so like box one, but he's adding in one uh, extra note there he may be doing something a little bit different this is what it sounds like to me so it gets you close so just play it fast and uh, it gets the idea across so uh, that's 17 19 17 and then 18 20 so see that there so it's like you're doing a 
minor pentatonic, but you're adding in uh, that 18th fret into it. And then you, you bend again and come back down, work your way down the scale. So 20, 19, 17, and then does that pre-bend again. Land on the C on the B string. Uh, the 13th fret there and then he does this pentatonic lick in again in box one um, so you start on third string hammer five to seven and you strip skip a string to the first string on the fifth fret there so and then you hit it on the, the B string as well but it's kind of fast. And then come back down, fifth fret, eighth fret. And bend on the seventh on the third string. And then he kind of comes back, does some, some things with the, the scale, kind of noodling around there. Hey, I had fun with this solo. I hope you did too. If this helped you out. Leave me a uh, like, subscribe, comment, uh, and let me know if you'd like me to work up a tab for this. Have fun. Keep playing.